Valley Birds and Night Owls. My name is Nox, aka Mako, and welcome back to Planet Coaster Challenge Mode. This is not the park you remember. I know, I know what happened to it. Well, security happened to it. Because the park was spilt out so widespread, it was hard to take care of our security issues, and so this time around, I wanted to maybe build a compact park in this type of map. Why did I select this one specifically? Because of the terrain paints. We have so many different kinds. We have obviously like dark ones like that. Let me get rid of that. I don't want that there. We obviously have the light ones like the snow. We have something like this which could be useful maybe the sci-fi area and of course there's like a grassy type like that and also a grassy type like this. I think this was the one that was ooh. I just undid something. My bad. Let me rebuy that. I don't know exactly what that was. It must have. Ah, oh, it was a security uh, security camera right there. My bad. So, yeah, we have different terrain paints that we can use, and I think it's going to work really well for theming out different areas. Now, right now, we have enough money to actually afford a second Wild Blue, which is exactly what I did in the last challenge, at least how I started it, because, well, it seems like Wild Blue's just the way to go for starting this and trying to get some money. So let's go ahead and drop a second one somewhere around here. Is that right? Right there. Hmm. It looks to be about right. Sure, let's just consider that right and just place it somewhere like uh, there. Huh? And so we're going to place the entrance, I suppose, over on this side. Sure, it's going to look a little bit different than that one because the entrance on that one is on this side here. But I'm okay with that, and place the exit right up in there, and we only have less than $80 right now to work with, which is honestly not good, but, you know, we have to make do with what we have, so we're gonna try here. Let's see, we are using this gravel path here, so let's connect that up just like that. And we are charging for the entrance, because I figure that's probably gonna help us get some kind of money going, even though it seems like we have to drop down the price for our... Excuse me? <laughs> You have to drop down the price for the ride, which I'm thinking I'm going to switch over. <sighs> I keep clicking the wrong thing. I'm trying to grab this, and I keep clicking the wrong thing. My apologies. Let's go ahead and grab that up, and we're going to connect that up right over here. Let's just not... Nope, nope. That's not where I want it. Right over here is where I want it. Just... Well, I guess it could go for that. I could also go for this, but that means a really short queue, which I don't exactly think I want. Sure, let's just drop it up like that, and 4% queue scenery rating. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. All right, so we do have some money. So what I want to do is I want to add some bins and benches just because it's probably going to be the best thing for us. Let's go ahead and one, two, three, four, five, six. The uh, the bins and benches are actually pretty cheap scenery, even though, you know, it's not the best scenery, but it's scenery nonetheless. And we have some challenges available. So let's see. We have achieve a monthly profit of $1,000. Hmm... Hmm, I mean, I, I guess we could try. I guess we could try. Let me just pause here, though, because I want to get rid of the park entrance fee, because I have a feeling a lot of people are... Yeah, a lot of people aren't coming in because that park entrance fee is a little bit insane. Wow, everybody's leaving really angrily. This is not a good park. I know, I know, but we're trying to make it better by opening these rides at $14 a pop. Yeah, for sure. It's so expensive. Excuse me, you didn't... Wait, you probably did pay for park entrance. Never mind. Well, maybe the new people are going to be like, oh, yeah, wait, what, 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 just... Weren't you supposed to say... Oh, are these actually, like, popping out? I'm supposed, to, I'm supposed to put them on the path, aren't I? Well, there we go. We have some people actually just came into the park and they went... The ride wasn't supposed to ride with just two people on it. Come on! All right, we're going to switch this up because I am not liking that. You're going to go at full load only. That way we can try to get more people in the queues and get this working a little bit better. Is this still too expensive? It, apparently it is, even though, you know, we're not charging for the park entry. And people are just like, whatever, I guess I don't want to ride anything here. Clearly. That one's also expensive. Okay, what what is wrong with these people? Like, what's your childhood trauma? Seriously. All right, there's one person in the queue. There's th four more. Okay, so things are finally filling out, so we should be getting some money pretty shortly. As for this, what's the ride rating right now? 147, so we need one more... I want to say one more. Maybe it's not one more wild blue. Hmm. We need a few more wild blues, maybe to get that one. Achieve a monthly profit of $1,000. Ooh, we are so close, and the park's about to close. Never mind. <laughs> Park opens at 6, close at 10. It's almost 10. Yeah, we're not getting that this month. Maybe we'll get it next month, though, because it seems like, you know, we're making quite a bit of money from that. And... I do intend on placing another wild blue. I'm just trying to figure out where the heck I'm going to do it. Because clearly there's really no room over here. I mean, I guess I could put it like over here. 
extend the bathroom over there, but I feel like that's exactly what I did before, and that's not really what I would go with. Are we making some money right now? We are kind of making money right now. How are these actually going in terms of maintenance? You're okay. You're okay. If we ever get a, a maintenance person, we're going to make sure that these get taken care of as soon as possible, because clearly they are getting some kind of wear and tear, and that's not good for us. Right, so we have to achieve a ride rating of $200. I wonder if that includes... Uh-oh, all right. Well, rip to our money, because clearly right now we are going to have to get a mechanic, because that's just... This one's getting a little bit bad right now. So there we go, we're gonna pay for a mechanic. Oh, man. Oh, man, you guys, I thought we were gonna do really, really well right now, but it seems like that's just not the case. This guy, this poor guy, he's just standing there like, well... What do I do now? Yeah, you inspect that ride, dude. You inspect that ride, and you do your job right. All right, so... Rather than telling the mechanic what to do, let's see if maybe adding some kind of scenery here helps us with the ride rating. Because you know what? I never actually tested that out. Ooh, an alpine tree? Sure, don't mind if I do. Maybe putting them on this side is going to help, though. One, two, and three. Let's see. That did nothing. Oh, theft reported. All right, so we have our very first theft. You're on your way out, and you realize you were robbed. What? Are you the thief? No, there isn't much to do in the park. Were you the thief? Wait, you just came in. You could... I mean, technically, yeah, that kind of person could still be a problem here. Honestly, because, you know, oh, whatever. Whatever. I'm not going to bother too much with it. And I don't really see too many single people unless, you know, this person did it. It doesn't seem like that person actually did it. Who was it? We don't even have a janitor now, so it's not like I can blame him. My gosh. Well, <laughs> our park is not so good. It's really not good, and we're apparently going to tank it here, because uh, clearly, clearly some people are deciding to already start robbing, and now seems to not be... Ooh, ooh, there's a solo person. Are you a thief? No, you probably are the one that just came in. Fair enough, fair enough. All right, so now we're just going to sit here, collect some money, and we'll place another wild blue. I think it was with three that we were actually able to make enough money to do some research and get more rides. So let's just try to do that and see where it goes. Our third and hopefully our final wild blue has gone into play. So hopefully now we can make $1,000 and get, uh, let's see, this one right here. Wait, why didn't we get the... We're two points off from the ride rating. Is that a joke? It wants us to place one more ride. Uh, we didn't even get a thousand dollars. Okay, do we have to place one more for reals? Because I really would like to keep it to just three wild blues for now because more than that is a little bit annoying. Let's just see what people are complaining about because they're always complaining about something. So let's see. Septon sick. Wish there were more rides. The queue is full. This, oh, you want a toilet? You want a drink shop? Ooh. They want things that make us some monies. We could definitely do a little bit of that. I think what we're going to do is maybe... Just do the standard ones here without any scenery, and later on, we will build scenery around it, and I, I promise, I promise, it's not going to be janky-looking scenery, okay? Let's see, we're going to go ahead and add, ooh, boy. Like that? Theft reported, great, we don't even have the money for that, so, <laughs> chill game, chill. Let's go ahead and do it up like that so people can stop complaining about needing to go to the restroom. Oh, excuse me. Hold, 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 hold. Who do you guys think you are? You are not getting in free. No, you're paying a dollar. Jeez, they're like, oh, I'm so glad this is free. No, it's not free. Trust me, it's not free. Oh, boy. All right, so they got the uh, bathroom now. What else do they need? I think they need a drink shop and a food shop. Oh, they are really hungry and thirsty, huh? Hmm, that means that we're probably going to have to put a security guard somewhere over here if we do this. So let's just do it. And hopefully we won't live to regret it. So let's see. Actually, I want to add it to whatever building we added this to. So let's go ahead and edit this. And we want to add Le Givif, of course, naturally. And apparently Cosmic Cow. There we go. So now we have our little area over here for food and drink and everything else that we need. Hopefully these things can make us some money. And I know now we're paying off some staff. Hopefully they can pay themselves off because... I really don't want to deal with any of that right now. Active vandalism seen on camera. Who was it? Who needs to get to... Oh, he's already fixing it. That's so nice. Who was it? Was it you? Some... Oh. Someone is breaking... Oh, I thought this person was like, some things need breaking. No, someone is breaking things in the park. This park could do it. Expanding a little. Yeah, don't worry. We're going to get there. Someone is vandalizing. Okay. Okay. We're going to get there soon. I don't, I don't see anybody who really vandalized. Were you, was it you guys? What did I just say? No, I don't think it was them, but we saw it happen. 
I guess, you guys, I guess, to save our butts, we can get the security guard right now, which means we're going to be paying out so much money right now. I hope we can make it back in what we have over here. Seems like maybe Cosmic Cow Milkshakes is not the best thing to put, because um, it's a little bit cold in here. Maybe it's uh, not really a nice type of drink, but that's really the only thing we have, so unfortunately, everybody's going to get brain freeze. Because, you know, it's cold, they're going to be drinking cold stuff, it's just not going to be good. Should we charge more for this stuff how's it going right now it's going actually oh it seems kind of okay at times and other times it's just like nah. we have about an hour and a half left to make a thousand dollars yeah it seems like we're actually not doing pretty well on getting our challenges completed i am going to remove this one because that one we can't really do right now coasters are a little bit later they're not going to come anytime soon so we're going to leave that for later on I, we need a janitor However, I want to make that $1,000. Ugh. How, how angry are people? Negative seven. All right, you know what? Maybe, maybe just clean it up and we'll see how this goes. If it seems like we're losing too much money, then yeah, we're going to make sure that we fire most of our staff because right now we have... Ooh, what the heck is this person's name? We have a lot of staff, but what what is your name? Let's see. What do you even look like? Um, I, I mean, I don't know. We're, we're gonna, let's see. It looks like you might have a fro underneath the hat, so sure, let's just call you fro. Because <laughs> honestly, I don't know. Average, what, 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 why, how is it declining when we literally just placed down a janitor to take care of all the mess? We have a mechanic right there to take care of broken rides. We have a security guard to take care of thieves and vandals and everything else. This is the tiniest park in the world and it should be working, but it's somehow not exactly working. And we just lost tons of money. Because that broke down. Was this not set to, um... It is. Weird. Totally weird. Let's also set this one just to make sure that it stays kind of, sort of, okay. Alright, so we should be making money. Ooh, we have almost enough money for another wild blue. Tempting. Very, very tempting. But I'm going to say no. Oh, boy. Someone just vandalized. And I don't think we caught it because, uh... Well, they already probably pieced out. Was it you? Uh, no. Man, we're never gonna catch them. I feel like I should probably just stick the security guard in there and have him watch them. Where is he anyway? I see the janitor. I see the mechanic. Where is the security guard? Am I blind right now? I might be blind, you guys. Did Wait, did he, like, quit or something that I didn't see? Oh, he's right there. He's definitely right there. Alright, the janitor needs to move. I don't know what he's doing hanging out over there. You, sir, have to come over here because there is a big mess over here. Which means that we're probably going to have to lay down some bins... Oh, good. don't you just love it when you restart a game and everything goes bad just because, you know, it's it's been so long that you don't really remember exactly what it is that you need when you restart. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. There we go. So, please, everybody, stop making messes. You are not being friendly when you make messes, okay? Okay? So, just keep it just like this, and we should be good to go. Ooh, maybe? Maybe? All right, so plans for this park, <laughs> rather than just dealing with this the whole time. Plans for this park. I will actually put back a moat and a castle, but however, I'm thinking that the castle here is not going to be a regular castle. Maybe instead it's going to be something of a gingerbread castle. What do you guys think about that? Because I, I, I know I want a moat. Like, no matter where I go, I'm going to add a moat because, ooh, oh, ho, ho, ho. Because it just seems like the right thing to do. And now we have another $1,000 right there. Thank goodness we actually completed that challenge. Jeez. That was a little bit difficult. But yeah, definitely a moat. Definitely will have different themed areas. Uh, I'm not entirely sure which ones. I know I still want an international area because before I was never actually able to build that up. But I would love to have that. And let's see. This is pretty snowy. So again, it's going to have maybe a festive themed area. Definitely in the front of the park, I will make it, you know, just generic. Same thing as before. Because I kind of like that idea. And I guess now that we have money, we can go ahead and start research. So let's see, what do we want to research first? I think it's probably going to be a good idea to research one of these so we can maybe make some more money from them. Because <laughs> honestly, we need something that's a little bit better than what we have currently. And no track rides for now because they're just too expensive for what we have. So let's see, we want to go ahead and suspend your disbelief or twist and spin. I think twist and spin might be forge. So let's go ahead and get forge. And oh, we can actually afford to maybe get both of them. Well, you know what? No, I'm only going to research one of them. Reason being that <laughs> afterwards we're going to need money to actually place down the ride. And look, I know, I know that we have loans, 
But I really don't want to go there because then we have to pay interest and, well, right now seems to not be the best. Are you chasing people out or are you just like walking around doing absolutely nothing? It seems like you're doing nothing. Dude, someone literally just vandalized right in front of your freaking face and you were just like, mm, well, I guess it's okay. Wh what? What kind of freaking sec- Okay, I think we have to train him. He's a pretty bad security guard, honestly. Okay, so cameras. Let's go ahead and put some cameras over here because clearly we don't have anything actually watching to see who the heck the vandal was. And, you know, there's usually a thieving here. So I guess maybe one here, one here makes some sense. And I know they cost us a little bit of money, but we should be good. We should be good with, let's see, we have one, two, three, four. Mm, did I miss one over there? I didn't put one over there, you guys. Oh, that's so bad. That is so bad. Okay, my apologies. Let's put one over here because clearly we need to watch this just in case something happens. I'm not sure if this path is covered. I honestly don't know the radius of this. So I'm just going to assume that this one and this one actually have it covered. If they don't, well, mm, shrug. Because <laughs> honestly, I, I don't know what to do for that then. I don't want to I don't want to play so many cameras because they have their own monthly running costs. And how much are we... Yeah. Look how much mo money we're losing per month because of that many cameras. It's not a good thing, and right now we're not making any money with us because, you know, we're researching a little bit, and this is almost done, actually. Thank freaking goodness, because resting only on wild blues. Ooh, a theft reported. Let's see. That was going a little bit... Excuse me? Did the person leave? D th th they left. How are we supposed to find thieves if you guys are leaving? <gasps> it was the janitor. No, I'm kidding. It was definitely not the janitor. People were getting robbed even before then, and I don't see any solos here. Hmm... Who might the thief be? Yeah, there's- oh, you're solo. <laughs> there's a lot of things damaged around here. Yeah, you know what? No, I'm not gonna be mean. I'm not gonna be mean. This person seems to be kind of okay. It's just, you know, there's a lot of things wrong in this park and this person realizes that there are a lot of things wrong in this park. Wait, you, Mr. Blue Jacket Shirt type thing over there, what are you doing? You're- they're in a hurry. Who's in a hurry? Who's in a hurry? What- 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 what's, what's even going on over here? No, you seem to be fine. Maybe. Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. Do we already, like, judge you? I think we already judged you. Okay, my bad. This view sucks. Okay, you know what? You suck. Oh, my gosh. These people. These people. All right. Yeah, you know what? Just go, go off. Have fun. Have fun. We're about to place another ride so that you guys can be like, oh, look, another ride. I guess this park is kind of okay now. Isn't that right? Oh, boy. Here we go again. Losing more money because that's the last thing we need right now. Come on, game. Be a little bit nice to us. We're almost... We're almost there. Research is ready to be revealed, and we have the Sizer. Wait, Sizer? That is not what I was expecting at all. What the? 3M Classic. Oh, is that the Forge? What the heck is the Forge even? I thought the Forge was one of the earlier ones. Can we even afford Sizer? <laughs> like, can we afford this thing? Oh, we can. It's, um... It's not the best ride. It's honestly not the best ride. And I don't feel so good about putting it down right now, but I guess we're going to have to because clearly we don't really have too many things to place down right now. Can we place it, like, up here? Is that even part of the park? I think it is, but... Interesting terrain. What? So I'm going to float it. Gotta love mountains, you guys. Gotta love mountains. Well, I was thinking I could probably just place it over here and then connect it up with the path right there. But if it's going to be, like, this annoying to do, I might not do this. This might be a place for maybe coaster... Oh, it looks like it's actually still sunk in there a little bit. Well, that might be fine. That might just be fine. I'm trying to use as much of the space here as is possible. Let's see, does that look okay? That looks perfectly fine, honestly. All right, so let's try to do this without maybe making a mess. So let's see, I want to put this maybe right over there. Place this right over here and connect that with the path. Oh, oh. So many vandals. What's going on here? We are, um... It's a negative one. <laughs> it's not so good, but we're getting there. We are definitely getting there, so we'll be there pretty soon. Uh-oh. Uh, seems like Fro actually quit. Wait, come on. We gave you a name and everything. You quit on us? Ugh, how rude. That means that our staff are probably having really rough times right now, which means they probably want to raise, which is honestly something I don't want to do. Or we can train them. I think that's probably going to be the best thing for us, and we probably have to train you a little bit so you can do a little bit more work there. Alright, so poor Fro. Fro was not having it at all. My apologies, Fro. I just, I am so bad. Alright, <laughs> I am just so, so bad at this, apparently. Let's see, so this weird road here. I suppose it could do something like that. Mm, kind of like it like that more, though, because it seems just like it's going to work a little bit better. Or we could just turn it. It's probably not a bad thing to turn it, huh? Yeah, you know what? Let's just do it up just like that. So now it's connected there, and we have a path going up to here, which... 
honestly seems kind of cool. However, for the queue, we're going to have to, you know, actually make it part of the regular path here because we aren't really going to make a queue that's that long. It just seems really pointless. So let's see. For the queue, I think I want to do something like, excuse me? Ex ex excuse me? What the? Terrain to uneven path. Great. So can you actually make it like proper path here? Dude, what are you doing? There we go. My gosh. That's... What the... Oh, I guess it's... No, what? It can go that way, but it can't go this way. Um, That's very interesting, I, I guess. I don't really like the way that looks there. I could take it there. Now, you know what? Let's go back here. I think I'm just going to bring it down like this and then turn it over with a regular path because I don't want to deal with the uh, the problems here. So let's just do this and connect it over with this. This is probably like the ugliest queue we have right now. Maybe to date, actually, now that I think about it, but it's going to work. Right, so now we have a new challenge. I'll take a look at that in a second because, of course, I want to open this guy up. Ooh, that's not wild blue. I want to open this guy up. Let's see. What's going to be the price? $6. I think maybe 10 might be fair enough. And let's open that one up. We should have completed challenge. Yes. <laughs> so now we have to build a coaster with at least two inversions. Um, I still don't think we're at the part where we can actually build coasters. I'm just going to remove that because... That's not going to get done anytime soon. Is this too expensive? That is too expensive. All right, let's try $9. This is why I didn't really want Sizer. You can't really charge much for it. So I don't know if it's really going to make much money. Right now, we are losing money. Hardcore. Hardcore losing money. Probably because we train people up. Probably because we're paying them so much money. But we have to just to keep them happy and make some kind of money. Right, guys? So hopefully, it's going to work. Sizer seems to be okay at $9. Even though there's still some people saying it's too expensive. At least this way will keep the queue a little bit short, right? At least that's my thinking of it. That's my way of thinking about it. Right, so now that we have some more things over here. Ooh, a thief has been caught. Nice job, security guard. Right, now that we have, you know, some more stuff over here, I guess we're going to have to place down some more cameras because clearly, clearly this area is not actually guarded by anything or anyone. Maybe, you know, security guards can come here occasionally, but not often enough. At least not for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to place this something like uh, active vandalism scene on camera. Good. At least, you know, we're seeing things. Hopefully we can catch them. Isn't that right, security guard? Because you should be able to know. Do they know? Do they know when something like that happens? Then they can go like, oh, yeah, you. You're the one who did this. Get out of here. Like, I, I don't know if they're going to do that. Hmm. Interesting. Oop, I don't want that there. I want that over here. Interesting thing that I've never actually noticed before. Well, hopefully this works. And let's see, we are currently making money. Nice. Although we're not making much money. Not so nice. So, um, right. Vandals, vandals, vandals. The mechanic has been taking care of all the broken benches. That's, you know, the first good thing about this. Despite the uh, obvious security problems. And $350 that we have to keep paying for our cameras just to make sure that things are okay. It seems like we're almost at 1000 but it's fluctuating way too much for me to feel comfortable. So I think the staff that we have right now is definitely good, even though the security guard seems to be having a bit of a hard time. That's not okay. So let's go ahead and get this, and hopefully it's going to be one of the rides that we... Oh, boy. <laughs> I may have spoken too soon, you guys. I thought things were going okay, but it seems like Wild Blue had other ideas. It appears that right now, most of the complaints are about full queues, vandalism, and wishing there were more rides. So let's see what we have here. We have Tristorm. Oh, come on. I only want Forge. What is Forge considered even? Maybe... I don't think it's this one, though. That seems a little bit weird, but I will maybe do a search on that one if we can't afford this one. We can afford this one, actually, and it's just as lame as this. What? How are these supposed to be thrill rides? Like, no wonder maybe that queue isn't full because, you know, it's not really a thrill ride in the traditional sense of things, at least the way I think about it. Well, let's go ahead and maybe place this one somewhere over here. I gotta float it a little bit just so we can get it down. There we go. And I guess, you know, we're just gonna <laughs> place a ton of rides on this ridge over here, which is pretty close to the edge of the park, but I guess this is okay. Let's see, I want to just, I guess I can just drop it right there. That should be fine. Yeah, you know what? Let's do some more research. Let's try suspend your disbelief because I'm not so sure where we're going to get the forge. The forge seems to work out pretty well for the most part, which is why I would love to get it. And oh, I just realized I messed up a little bit. Let me take that right out and I'm going to have to replace it because I did not actually move the control booth over to the side. There we go. I like to have it like to have it like the butt sticking out, you know, from the roller coasters, the butt sticks out a little bit. Yeah, with these rides, I kind of want the same thing. Let's go ahead and do something like that. We're going to place the entrance maybe over here, the exit right over on this side, like that maybe. And let's connect this guy up over with this here, because I think that's going to be for the best. Ooh, that's a little bit weird looking. 
It's definitely janky, but it's gonna work. And now we're gonna have to, ooh, we're gonna have to move the security camera. And it's gonna take care of maybe both of these areas. That would be nice. All right, so let's, no wild blue. It's not your time to shine. This is the camera's time to shine, okay? It's time for the camera. Just chill out, right? There we go. So we're gonna go ahead and drop this like right up in there and hopefully that's gonna work for us. Let's go ahead and get ourselves a nice little queue and we're gonna go ahead and connect it up with this. Oh, I really don't like where that is. I really, really do not like where that is. So, nope, not wild blue again. We're gonna go ahead and place the entrance again. I guess right next to this? Maybe that's gonna give it the look that I kinda want. Oh, that's not what I wanted either. Let's go ahead and go down. Sure. That's a pretty long queue, honestly. I guess it's fine. I guess that's okay. We're just gonna finish it off with the regular path just to make sure that, you know, we don't make this superbly long. So how can we do this? Let's see, I wanna actually use this. Ooh, that's kind of fugly looking. I don't really like the look of this anyway. The heck? This just looks bad overall. Oh, maybe I could do it like that. That looks not that bad, honestly. It's uh, like the curve is a little bit weird, but that's okay. Sure, let's just do that up just like that. And let's see, this ride is going to be $8, no. I think we're gonna charge $11 and hopefully that's gonna be enough for it because I would love to charge 12, but it seems like for these rides, People don't like to pay that much money on it. On, on, on. <laughs> what the heck were they saying there? People don't like to pay that much money, honestly. I was trying to say honestly, but it just came out super weird. My apologies. Right, so now we have one, two, three, four, five. And of these five rides, we only have three that are different. But that's okay, because you know what? We can still make money that way. So we have no active challenges, surprisingly enough. Oh boy, is this ride getting super popular? It is. No, Wild Blue, go away. This one is, it, huh? Apparently it's too expensive, but the queue is like practically full. Let's just try this and see if that works. This one seems to have a pretty long queue as well, but it seems like the queue doesn't fill up that quickly. So maybe, maybe just maybe we're at an okay price for that one. All right, there aren't any bins over here, so I'm gonna leave it just like that to see if we end up with messes there, because that's one of the things that we really have to watch out for at times. Sometimes, you know, you didn't, you don't realize where you put bins and where you don't, and then you end up with a bunch of messes. So I want to see if we put bent like bins every, you know, every few. Let's put this like a square like this. Every few squares like that. So clearly, this is a square here. This is a square here. If we do it like every two squares or something like that, so it's gonna be like one here or nothing here, one here, nothing here, one here. Although there's some in both of them. I know that probably doesn't make any sense, but I'm trying to draw it out so maybe it can make some sense? I don't know. But that's just the way I'm trying to think of it in terms of, you know, trying to save some money by not placing so many bins and benches throughout the whole park. Because last time it felt like maybe I was placing a little too many in certain areas and not enough in other areas. So I'm just trying to get a nice little balance and wow, we are making money now. We are definitely making bank. So I'm quite happy with the way things are going. Oh, it seems like we have found... A, th a theft reported over here. So let's see who is um, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Why? How does this happen every single time? Okay, maybe you are it. Um, I'm super excited this park looks nope. You're not it. Hmm Who else might be alone here? I just don't like it that you know Sometimes the thieves walk in groups like walk among other people So you can't really tell who's alone and who's not like orange boy over here Couldn't really tell that orange boy was alone, but it seems like he actually is Oh, no, you're okay. Never mind. You're just fine. Maybe you are the thief. Lovely. Couldn't ask for better food. Oh, you actually like our food. I apologize for actually thinking you might have been a thief. Well, I guess we're not finding that thief, but hopefully the security guard does, because clearly he has to be better at his job. Speaking of, though, how are our staff members? Ooh, somebody's really not happy because he has a high workload, so we're going to go ahead and just, you know... Continue training until that person's actually happy, and if need be, I guess a pay raise will be in order. But for now, you know, we're making some money, so <laughs> I'm not too concerned with that. Uh oh there was some vandalism, and it was the security guard nearby? I wasn't even, like, watching anywhere. We have so many bins and benches, honestly. I wouldn't be able to tell where it happened, like, straight away. Hey, look at that, we have our research ready to be revealed. Please be good. It is the insanity. Oh, no, not that ride. It seems like none of these are the ones that I want, you guys. Like, I would love Cube right now. Cube we can charge an arm and a leg for. I would love that. Well, what kinds of coasters do we have here? Do we only have one? We only have one kind. Oh, jeez. I think the only blueprint I have for this one is something that's really, really expensive. Yeah. That is too expensive for my current blood, so that's not happening right now. We could get sp specially abnormal. 
Nah, I think I want to stick with the thrill rides and let's just do the research for both of these since it seems like we can afford one. It wants me to build coasters. It really wants me to build a coaster. I mean, I will soon. I'm going to keep that one because we still have room for two more challenges. I'm going to keep that one and if it, it's. It comes to the point where, you know, we're completing challenges often, then I guess it's going to be okay. Let's go ahead and pay for that as well so we can get more rides coming in a little bit faster. That way we can have the money coming in faster. Right now we have 500 people in the park, which is a quarter of the amount of people that I want in total for now. Because obviously if, you know, we have 4,000 people coming in all the time, then we're going to have tons of lag. And that is not what we want to go with. Right. Oh, it looks like the paths might be a little bit congested. What? kinds of things are people complaining about right now? Queue is full, queue is full, queue is full, that looks busy, queue is full. Oh, well then, I guess that's okay, because, you know, it's not the worst kind of complaint. It's one that, you know, means that we're actually filling up queues and getting the money that we need, so I guess that's just fine, but it seems like maybe we could do with another restaurant and another drinks place, so let's see, where shall we place those? Maybe back here. So let's just go ahead and pause that so we can just swap back over here and maybe place down our next... Well, I guess Chief Beef is going to be the best one to get, so I guess we're going to get another Chief Beef. And of course, another Cosmic Cow, because that's the only drinks place that we currently have. So let's go ahead and do something like that. And add in... And we have ice cream, but ice cream is probably a bad idea. Yeah, we're going for a Chief Beef, and unfortunately it seems like this one's not going to work. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab this building and move it around until they both align. And it seems like maybe it's not going to happen, is it? Are you kidding me? How is this... How is that one not aligning? Game, what are you doing? Game, what? Okay, they both align when they're there. Are you... Uh, but not here. Wh why? Can I turn it a little bit? Maybe there? Nope, that's not happening. What is going on? What the heck is going on? Okay, whatever, whatever. It is what it is. Let's just drop them there and pretend like nothing ever happened. Oh, maybe not there. For the back, sure. Let me, let me just turn this a little bit like... Oh man, trying to get it just fine means I have to slow down my mouse a little bit because uh, clearly it's not working if it's that fast. Mm, I'm going to go ahead and drop it right up in there. All right. Okay, so now we're going to have to pay off two more staff members. Hopefully, these will pay themselves off because I honestly do not want to have to deal with that. And I know I said the whole thing about the bins, but... Now that we're getting some food in here, I think adding one right next to that is going to help and maybe a few benches along the way here just to make sure that people aren't, you know, walking away with the food or most people aren't walking away with the food and they're actually sitting to enjoy the food and wow, look at that. <laughs> look at how quick people flock to that. Yeah, not so much this one. It seems like the complaints for Chief Eve or oh, maybe that's actually never mind. I was going to say, it seems like the complaints for Chief Beef were actually not valid. No, they are actually totally valid. All right, my apologies, my apologies. And these seemingly are still doing pretty well, so we should be turning over quite a nice profit. Good. There is some more vandalism happening. I am still no, no surprised. I mean, the guest happiness is pretty low, and I'm sure people are just getting really, really mad about the queues being filled up all the time. Arr. Like, seriously, everybody, get over it. Get over it. All right, so we have another theft reported, and it seems like it's somebody who's actually leaving right now. So how do you want us to actually find your money if you're piecing out? What? 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 <sighs> Whatever. I'm not even going to bother with them. There's a lone person right there. I know I'm profiling, but let me just, you know, let me just look. There's a chase happening. Oh, you seem to actually think that's... Wait, I think I'll call it a date. Oh, that means that you're probably just leaving. You're just like, oh, I guess I'm bored. I'm piecing out. Yeah, fine. That's fine. You're not a thief. Maybe. Maybe. Another act of vandalism. Oh, oh, did you just see? It was these people. I saw you. I saw you. Wow, that guard is flying by to get to you, I hope, because you guys were... Uh... Right, are you leaving? Yeah, fine. Fair enough. You know what? You get away with it this time, but next time you're going to kick the heck out of here. Oh, and the vendor has quit. Oh, boy. I thought we were doing enough for him, but it seems like that was just not the case. So we kind of wasted money, huh? Didn't we? We actually wasted money by training him up and not giving him better pay. Ew, I didn't like that. Well, the security guard seems to need a better pay, so let's go ahead and bump him up a little bit. I guess we are making enough money now. Well, maybe not this month, but we are making enough money now that I guess, yeah, we can consider doing that for sure, for sure. Maybe even bumping up to 200, because it seems like a little bit there was not enough at all. Average guest happiness is declining. Wow, you don't say. Maybe because everybody's actually wrecking the park and, you know, nobody's taking care of it. Is that right? Is that right? You guys are making the park disastrous on your own, and then... Oh my gosh. 
Oh my gosh, look at this mess. I have to watch out for who these people are. We have cameras like right there and the cameras are seeing it, but we can't really do much about it, which is dumb. Anyway, let's see. We have Zozo. Okay, fair enough. And Rolling Mines is Psychola. Oh boy, Psychola. Psychola. Oh, you guys already know. If you've watched my previous series or the previous part of the challenge, I guess you could say, you know how much I don't like Psychola because it doesn't seem to make money. Well, we could try it. We can definitely try it. We could try a few of these rides, actually. Zozo might work pretty well because Zozo has in the past done a pretty fair job. So let's see what we can do about placing this one down. I guess we could start lining this road up here with some rides. So yeah, let's do that up and see how that goes for us. Let's see, you want to go ahead and line this up. Ooh, just like that. Sure, sure. Seems like it's close enough. Just there we go. So let's drop that right up in there. And of course, we're going to do the same thing that we did with Wild Blue. We're going to go ahead and drop the entrance, I guess, on this side, the exit, right in smack dab, right in the middle. Yeah. And we're going to go ahead and connect that up just like one, two, I guess, turn it right now. That means we're going to have to move those benches. I think that's okay. I think that's a fair enough thing to do. Right. So we're going to go ahead and move those benches over one here. I guess we could probably put the other one right over here. I think that's going to work. Right, so let's go ahead and get ourselves a nice little cue path over here so we can connect it up right into this right here. Is that how we want it to look? Not so much. Can I actually make one more? I think that's maybe going to be too much. Yeah, that starts to look a little bit funky, actually. But actually, that works. That does work. That looks kind of nice. Good, so now we have quite a few rides. Let's go ahead and open out. Ooh, we can charge a lot more for this one. Let's go for $14 on this one and see how that works. I'm honestly not liking that too much, but you know what? I don't really want to spend too much money on that. That seems to be a fair price. Well, we have a few other rides to place down, and hopefully, you know, adding more and more thrill rides is going to help us make some money, and we're going to try to keep it, you know, the park in this little area for now until we can maybe add a coaster and then I'll try to focus different things around coasters that way we can have a coaster per themed area at least at least one coaster I might add a second one later on but we shall see in the next episode because that is it for this episode of planet coaster challenge mode if you enjoyed hit that like button share support and to subscribe if you already haven't but as always thank you so much for watching and have an awesome night.